Well, good afternoon. Uh, I'm just going to do a very quick uh, video now that I've repaired the uh, 53131 uh, a and uh, we're going to run it through its calibration routine. Uh, it's uh, afternoon here, drink of choice is a nice hot chocolate uh, from the Keurig machine. So, how you get to the calibration menu is by holding down the scale button and then cycling the power. And what it will do is it'll bring you to uh, either this menu here saying Cal Secure or uh, a menu that says Cal Unsecure. Now, uh, the Cal Secure basically means there's a code been put in that would stop you from running the calibration uh, stuff. Now, most of the time when you see this though, the Cal Secure is still the default setting um, from the uh, factory. So we can hit scale offset to get to the code and the default setting is in fact just the uh, model number and you're going to enter and sort of move uh, the cursor position to the left as you go through so you want one three one three one two three four five and there we go and now we're in Cal Unsecure so now we can go through and do the uh, offset so there are a number of different uh, you know have a number of different uh, calibration settings uh, and we can go through and do all of those. So we'll start off with uh, offset one. So remove the inputs from channel one and then press enter and there it's calibrated one. So now we can go do two it's going to tell us the same thing. Remove the uh, inputs from channel 2. And then press enter. So we've passed there. So let's now do gain on 1. We hit it again. And it's going to tell me to supply 5 volt to channel 1. Okay. Okay. So now we have uh, 5 volts set, so we can press enter again. Oh. It helps if I actually turn it on. Okay, and now we'll go to gain two. And it will tell me to do the same thing. Okay, now the next two here, you see this time interval quick and time interval fine. Uh, what you want to do, unless you have the rest of the equipment required, is just do time interval quick here. And this is basically going to calibrate uh, the measurement, uh, you know, how it, uh, the time base and how it actually measures. Um, so we're going to do the quick and it will tell us to uh, supply a 10 megahertz signal. And then we're going to press enter. And we'll do it again because I uh, because I actually hit uh, I didn't have the output turned on. Okay, so now we have done the complete uh, calibration set up. Okay, so now we should be able to check the cal count. So we've done six calibrations, which we've gone through. So we're good to go. Now I'm not going to reset the secure code, so we can just turn that off. And now when we turn this back on again,
you see that uh, we don't get the uncalibrated signal again. So there we go. Uh, that was uh, running through the calibrations of a 53131A. Uh, I hope you found that interesting. And uh, check in for the next um, video where I'll add the uh, oven time base and um, the prescaler. Catch you later. Bye.